playback. Remember, this is a very rough cut, almost like watching rushes. A lot of the stuff will be thrown out during the actual editing. Here we are. Should be some sound coming in now. No, no, not yet. Here. <laughs> okay, kids. Who wants to draw me the scariest picture of a rabbit in the history of ever? Okay, then. What's your name, little friend? John, huh? John what? How's the balance? 
it's cool. I need to hear myself just a little bit more. No, excuse me. I'm sorry. I need to hear a little of the track more. Okay. You're on. The whole thing was supposed to last maybe a year or two. It was just something that I wanted to get out of me. And uh, as the thing escalated and, and went on, I realized that there was just so much more that I had to do. And the more I did, the more I wanted to do. And I said, fuck it. I just I always want, I mean, we always want to be music that rocks, you know, like, really rocks. And John always wanted to do weird shit with our songs in the studio, I mean, these string sections, I don't know. When we went to the studio, the lady, when we went to the studio, the lady on the billboard, I was like, John, what did you sing over this song? Thing. Not talk, I'm going to take a rap, but you're going to gangsta, which you're obviously not. I was like, hello, you're right. Brand new AK, he had a brand new Glock 9 and a brand new video camera. So we playing a playing some song, rapping on the video camera, playing with the guns and shit, and having a ball. And that was like just been released from their contract by Columbia when I approached them. At that point, they weren't having a lot to do with record labels. Uh, it took an entire summer of pursuit by myself, by my wife at that time, Nina, to pin the group down. And we finally had an agreement and put them into a recording studio. Every so often I've laid in some stock music to juice things up a little. Your name, please, for the viewers at home. This is Bill. When we finally got signed to a label, I honestly don't remember John being very happy about it. I mean, I think it made him happy. Happy for the band, I mean. Gig locally tongue. Stop working at Jaws. Be financed, get a deal using the new connection and the old ones. Become friends with Michael Stein. It used to be that uh, people were famous for being special. Now they're considered special uh, merely for being famous. The group reportedly turned down a million dollar deal from Capitol Records and instead signed with Geffen Records for $287,000. But when the album itself was released, it sold out the entire pressing of 50,000 copies in only a few days. Within four months, more than three million copies of the album were sold in the U.S. alone. John, John Rymble. Playback. You, but you just, you gotta have something to say. There are too many people out there that are getting popular, for lack of a better word, who really are saying much of anything in it. John, I want this material burned. All of it. Yeah. As I think we can stay in the head with a story, a minimal class, and, and the score that will result in my being hailed as a, as a creative genius. Kill me. Kill me. Oh no, my friend. You're going to be front row center in my triumph. After all, what good is the show without the critic? WSHT Shit Radio. Wake up, wake up, wake up, people. This is DJ Sit and Spin coming at you live from the sneaky side of this AM dawning. Serving you up the super fresh stuff from the farthest reaches of your FM dial. In today's news, you're late for work again. That's right, get your lazy ass up and out of that bed. Let's get those butt cheeks from the horizontal to the vertical, people. The traffic on I-85 is already backed up for six exits. So let's keep that road rage to a minimum, y'all. You must pop that Glock on your fellow commuters this morning. Please try to refrain from firing at school buses or at those handicapped people vans. You know the ones with all those folks who are waving and drooling down the glass? Give us a call here at 663-WSHT. If you're calling number 44, you're going to Graceland. That's right, Memphis, Tennessee, baby. All right here on the station you always count on to keep dropping you the fresh shit. WSHT Shit Radio. And you know that's the truth. All right, time to get...
get back to the music. For another 40 minutes of commercial free SHT. The calls have been coming in fast and furious for this one this week, and last week, and the week before that too. Number one on the SHT Battle Zone countdown for the last three weeks ago. It's Rifle for Billboard. Let's all take this. Come on out there, people. Let's wake it up. Oh, you haven't seen this billboard, he says to her. Wrapped up so pretty and won't that make things just that much better? Isn't it just the taste of death you've been looking for? She quick checks her makeup. And he quick checks his voicemail. And, and of, of course, course his email. User, user passwords must contain either F, G, H, etc, etc. The windshield opens up, begins to bleed backwards. Kissing this road. That road. You'd get there faster if you only just crawl. There, there, kiss, kiss. This acid fuels the gargle, makes the salt stains bitter. Wow. The editor of Insert the St. Ives Review, the new Sprite Times, the is fastened, slash, hog tied to my desk. No women, give me that goddamn grimmy. I'm sending out the disease MP3s, choking as my legs are force fed to kill a weed. I think I'll pass. Ah, uh, that's right, motherfucker. Hands up. Go right ahead believing we are the real things, dogs. Think you forgot to use spell check on your big interview cover story fluff piece fraud. How many shots to the dome do you think it will take to put my stupid ass to sleep? Do you fucking realize who I am, the peeps of which I creep? Boy, what big ears you have. And the satellite broadcast it goes live with the John Rifle. Links up in five, four, three, two. Pause. Projected up there on the bigger billboard, I see the gossips, the vultures, the vampires, wonder who's gonna be the next one stuck. Ouch, Eagerly drowning the witches to see if they'll float. Entertainment Tonight slash Weekly is in the bleachers taking remedial cliff notes. I saw you, you little snitch, hanging out with the crew backstage. What was your fame? Oh yeah, you fell off after being hyped the fattest and the freshest queen of the dam. I think her name was uh, I think her name was uh. Get it already. Anyways, quote, quote, Miss X admits she's worried about AIDS. Don't share hats, coats, or brushes. But adds, someone once read my fortune and told me I wasn't going to live much beyond the age of 4T. So I'm sure as hell gonna enjoy myself now. You tell him, girl. Ah, yes, here comes Mr. Scarecrow. Watch him step up, surveying the newest billboard. Tumbles down off that elevator, smear smirk. With the false prophet of straws, his every move is tried up a sound scan. Trademark. Oh, look, now it's Mr. PR, man. He's slithering forward, just watches his claws rip through Mr. Scarecrow's chest. Slicing his paws past the breastplate, begins to massage Mr. Scarecrow's heart. I'm getting busy with Mr. Stiffy, cause my latest plan has already gone 7 million strong. I get jiggy, cause I know the kids are blasting my 01 shit out the back of mommy and daddy's ride. Flash. Car. The Azor embryos of the does. They never flinch to the constant barrage of these voyeuristic body blows. Born and bred for my dead. It'll be like that from womb to tomb. But first, let's get back down in the dressing room. A damp towel smothers the fire under the door. As I tiptoe over the broken skeleton of the nameless slash useless little rabbits only you would place on ignore. And now the understudies, you just say, this will only sting for just a second. Keep squeezing my hand. You can trust me, this won't hurt. Remember, we're friends. They place quarters on his eyes when he's finally ghost. With skin the color of whitewash, white out, mouthwash, and human soap. Must mash hush. Because don't you like to watch us stop, drop, roll like snowballs propelled? Our shiny riches are stitched in pen and pixel. We advertise this self-imposed fame. Flash. Cartel Still smiling that hot and sticky plush blanket Pull tight from of self-suffocate Unnecessary use of alliteration But hey, this little plastic trinket will be your greatest reward Oh honey, look, isn't that cute? They gone and made a totem out of that rabbit USA Today And then Teenage boy held in Deep breath High school slang Current cultural reference Walking by the box on the street USA Today And then Teenage boy held in Deep breath High school slang Current cultural reference Others were trapped inside a maze of classrooms. 
A SWAT team found victims sprawled throughout the school on the floor. The suspects were dead in the school library. I just started screaming and crying and telling them not to shoot me. And so we shot the girl. I mean, she shot her in the head in front of me. Learn more details about this deadly shooting at the school. We'll have much more coming up later in the newscast. There is other news tonight. Well, we could have a little laugh and relieve our own pain, I suppose. Right, I drink a little. I've smoked pot. I've tried heroin. I'm still in detox. I'm still medicated. And I don't think I'll be leaving out. I love to drink, I love to be fucked up, but I'm not going to drive anymore. And I think we should tell our fans, don't drink and drive. Not don't drink. Do whatever you want to do, man. Shoot up heroin. I don't care. Do it. Have fun. It's your life. Every single article, and it would be odd not to ask you about, 
is that I believe he didn't want to do the heroin thing. I'm not going to talk about it on the Today Show. It's not a demographic that I feel like talking about that. Are you filming?
harmful to some young people, especially vulnerable children and adolescents who are socially alienated from traditional value systems and positive support groups. Lawsuits filed against musicians by parents of suicide victims who felt that the music played a role. We realize that a normal, healthy teen will not commit suicide because of a song. However, teens who are emotionally distressed, alienated from others, unable to communicate, are especially susceptible to messages that are nihilistic, depressing, and suicidal. For the sake of everybody who listens to it, it's going to get involved in it, but there are some kids that pick up the message from the music, from the words of the songs, from the uh, album covers themselves. How kind of we are. How kind of we know to manipulate you. You merely say no. Winner of this year's People's Choice Award is John Rifle. debut on our countdown comes from John Rifle. Rifle's follow-up to last year's double platinum debut finds the band moving in a much more dark, introspective direction than heard in previous efforts. And even though they have been topping both the singles and the album charts for the last few weeks, don't plan on seeing the band on tour anytime soon. A press release from Rifle's record company tells us that the inclusive singer is taking some time off from touring in response to a doctor's diagnosis. Keep you posted as we learn more. learned from this unhappy rabbit. A dead rabbit is soon forgotten, but a rabbit that isn't dead, that is not quite dead,
WSHT Shit Radio. And in international news, American pop rocker John Rifle, on a month-long publicity tour of Western Europe, was rushed to Balbo Medical Center late last night in downtown Rome, Italy. SHT international correspondent Alicia Luciano reports. American pop star John Rifle was rushed to Balbo Medical Center here in Rome today after it is rumored the singer became unconscious on stage during the second night of a sold-out series of concerts at Rome's Pavilion Amphitheater. SHT sources report that the singer was airlifted to Balbo Medical Center, apparently displaying the effects of a drug-induced overdose. No confirmation yet if this early morning emergency room visit was the failed result of a tragic act of attempted suicide, but Rifle's record company is neither confirming nor denying this exclusive SHT report, offering only the comment of no comment. Not much solace for the millions of shocked fans waiting and watching around the world. This is Alicia Luciano reporting. Was hospitalized after OD during a trip to Rome, Italy. Gossip spread that he really had tried to kill himself. Gossip spread that he really had tried to kill himself. Italy. Gossip spread that he really had tried to kill himself.
would be received. It really hurt him. They would do things like play sound tapes of rabbits being slaughtered or they were trying to take somebody that they viewed to be unstable to start with and then they were trying to drive them crazy. The reality of being famous is kind of frightening in a certain way. Yeah, you look at any of these people that are now complaining about being too much in the spotlight or, or always, you know, scrutinized by everyone. What did you expect? Papa, <laughs> what are you going to do? Go kill yourself? You going to commit suicide? You know? I kill myself sooner! Do you want me to kill myself sooner? And then I think that, that to take yourself out at your peak, if, if you could die at your peak, your strongest point, and your soul will be that much stronger in the next existence. I mean, I would have ended up fucking shoving a gun down my throat. You've been hanged! You've been screwed by your hero!
And in international news, emergency room was rushed late last night. Singer became unconscious on state drug induced overdose. What's the matter with you? Where's your courage, your confidence in yourselves? Where is it?
going to be a 40 man on a 50. Why am I going to think that? Why am I going to think about that? I'm going to smile. Stop. 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 smart enough to stage his own death. That's what gave rise to that talk. He was the kind of guy that would have staged his death. He had reason to do it. On the other hand, he's still alive.
Shut it off!